ShotSpotter technology will start in two police precincts, Essex and Wilkins. It works by installing acoustic sensors around neighborhoods. ShotSpotter's algorithm then classifies types of sounds it hears as a gunshot or otherwise. Those sounds are reviewed by employees at the company who can then choose to alert the police. Jurors will continue deliberating Wednesday whether or not a teenage squeegee worker is guilty of murder. That teen is accused of killing Timothy Reynolds last year at an intersection in the Inner Harbor. Tuesday, jurors sent questions to the judge about clarifications concerning a mistrial. If the jury declares a mistrial, then the state will decide if it wants to retry the case. Acting Commissioner Richard Worley will discuss his plans for the department and also take questions. There will be seven community meetings in all. Worley's nomination hearing is scheduled for August 15th, though the earliest that he could be confirmed is August 21st. Today is the first of several public meetings on the mass transit line. The red line is set to run east to west from the Bayview area to 